My name is Helena Dingo and I go to school at Penn State University. I'm interested in geophysics and seismology and I'm also interested in GIS as well. So my research here is focusing on a new type of seismic sensing technology called distributed acoustic sensing and it works by a receiver fires a laser into a fiber optic cable and that laser reflects off of natural impurities within the cable and then the receiver measures the property of light as it comes back and that those properties can change based on strain on the cable which can be movement in the ground from seismic waves so in that way it can record seismicity i actually came into university as um, astrophysics so astronomy and astrophysics but I realized when we were doing the career circles and stuff like that, that a lot of the work that I would be doing is just computer programming. And I didn't want to be like stuck in a computer lab all day doing my work. So I looked for a degree that was a little more hands-on. And I noticed that the geoscience degree at Penn State had a six week long field camp. So that really enticed me and I decided to enroll in the program and then throughout all the classes I got really interested in the material. After my high school graduation my dad took me to the Grand Canyon for our senior trip and we camped in the Grand Canyon and I remember there was these labels on the ridge that showed you how the rock units changed in age as you were going down into the canyon. So I remember hiking into the canyon and like feeling like I was moving back in time as I went deeper into the canyon. So experiences like that and just always being interested in the you know world around me and natural environment definitely led me to geoscience. My parents have always been really supportive of you know, science and getting me into different educational camps. Like when I was in middle school, I went to a science camp and then later on in high school, I volunteered for the same science camp. It definitely fostered my curiosity a lot. Um, yeah, I just feel like I'm always interested in learning something new and uh, getting the opportunity to explore that in an environment that wasn't a classroom I think was very helpful for me because it, it gave me the freedom to ask questions that I wanted without the pressure of having to perform on tests and stuff like that. My parents are both in academia so it was really um, helpful for me to explore degrees with them and they knew a lot about the application process and going through college so that was really helpful. and and deciding what I wanted to do. For my future plans for this upcoming semester, I'm gonna complete my thesis at Penn State, and then I'm looking into applying to get a master's degree after this. I don't think I wanna go for the full PhD, but I'm at least going to start with a master's degree. I would like to work in the public sector for something like disaster preparation and mitigation, or something in maybe geothermal energy. This, this um, internship has gotten me really interested in geothermal energy as well, so something that would, you know, tangibly help people. I would say to not rule anything out. Definitely try a bunch of different classes. If you're set on going into science, there might be a specific discipline that you haven't considered, like me with geoscience, so really taking the time to explore what your university offers and what classes they have can help you hone what you're really going to be passionate about and what's going to help you get through those four years. <laughs>